Over the last two years or so, we've talked a lot about some of the projects that are changing the user experience in SAP S4HANA Cloud today. We talked about SAP Fiora Elements and the flexible programming model, which allows for more tailored SAP S4HANA apps. We talked about different UI adaptation solutions. We launched My Home for SAP S4HANA Cloud, and we went on to explore how to use artificial intelligence to improve the lives of our users. But recently, we've invested in enabling a more collaborative ERP experience. Katja, can you help us make heads and tails of all of these? For a developer perspective, let's start out with SAP Fury Elements. This is our metadata-driven UI technology. It is designed to provide consistent, enterprise-ready user experience while reducing the time and effort spent to create these apps. While most apps at SAP fall into a few general categories, we have also introduced a flexible programming model to allow applications that don't look like one of our six standard floor plans. If you are not a developer, most SAP S4HANA screens provide an Adapt UI option to allow key users to adjust the UI quickly. For SAP Fury Elements apps, we rely on SAP UI 5 flexibility to accomplish this. For classic transactions, we are now providing personalization through SAP screen personas in SAP S4HANA Cloud. So far, so good. Now we know how apps are built efficiently and how customers can make them their own. Historically, customers have spent a lot of time building custom business logic. With all that drive for efficiency and reduced setup time, how can we help customers reduce that upfront investment? We are currently exploring ways to leverage artificial intelligence to streamline data entry operations. This is something which would have acquired sophisticated customer-specific backend logic. But today, we can leverage SAP BTP artificial intelligence services to learn from previous user inputs and then take over repetitive entry tasks. I've used a prototype based on that idea, since it's not yet productized, but it's amazing to see how much faster you are with a robot making suggestions along the way. Now, of course, all these consistent and intelligent apps also need to be accessed by our users. This is where my home for SAP S4HANA Cloud really shines. It's based on our SAP Launchpad, but we designed it with a slightly different intention, right? Yes. We designed My Home to not only surface available apps, but it is designed to draw the user attention to situations that require manual intervention and to provide an easy entry point for pages and spaces that customers can already configure today in SAP S4HANA Cloud. My Home also surfaces relevant news content and can provide cards visualizing different aspects of the system right on My Home. I just said manual intervention. So if our best-run processes need a human decision, that is where we talk about the collaborative ERP. Together with Microsoft, we've launched a campaign to bring direct personal interaction to SAP S4HANA Cloud. We're planning to support this out of the box in SAP Fiora Elements, but we are currently planning to release a Microsoft Teams app to help streamline this collaboration. In your SAP S4HANA system, you can easily open an app and discuss the approval of a credit limit increase directly in Microsoft Teams or Outlook. We are using Microsoft Adaptive Card-based loop components for this integration. And we are planning to create these cards just like SAP Fury Elements apps driven by metadata. This is where we are today with bringing UX innovation to SAP S4HANA Cloud. But we have a lot more ideas and we really love to hear your feedback.